Okay, so this afternoon's game, we are playing Spectre Ops. Fantastic looking board. You got a couple of miniatures down here. And what do we have? So, Anna. Hi. Is going to be the agent hunting me down. No, I'm the hunter. You're, You're the hunter. You're the hunter. <laughs> that makes more sense. And who are you? You're the beast. I'm the beast and the gun. We we're playing two gun. player. So and I get to be two characters. We need some barriers up so she can't see who I am. And we'll see how this goes. I'm going to beat him. She probably is going to beat me. Last time I was the agent and he was the hunter and I won. You did. And I didn't. And I, I have never played hunter before. I didn't um, think you were going to. And you did. So. Okay. Well, we'll tell you how the outcome turns out. So, after losing pretty badly at Spectre Ops, I am going to attempt to build a metal AT-AT. Here are the instructions. Here are the metal sheets. And when everything is said and done, it should look like that. Let's see how it turns out. Well, that ended miserably. Um, as you can see, the head broke off. I mean, I don't know if it's, I was too rough with it or what, but if you, let me see if I can show you some other parts here that might have um, right over here. You can see that they are kind of like grooved lines to help you fold um, and it looks like I was bending it back and forth too many times and it broke. And the reason why that happened, when I was putting the head together, it shows you to put the head together, you fold it into place, um, and then you got to put the bottom piece on over here, but then you have to open the head back up to bend these little hooks, so you can even see them. These little hooks have to be bent, so I had to widen the head again, and then close it, and another time over here to put the neck on. So with all that folding it and unfolding it, it snapped at the little grooves. So this was a failed attempt at an AT-AT. -AT. I will keep the extra parts, because I'm assuming if I attempt to do this again, uh, in case I break any more parts, hopefully I can have some spares um, and maybe a little more gentler in the future. So if you're looking to build one of these metal earths, be very gentle and take your time.